Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have another unboxing. This time this is going to be a mechanical keyboard and this is from the brand Red Dragon. So this is actually a mechanical keyboard. I wanted to upgrade it from Membrane. So this keyboard has one special option which is you could change the switches which I would cover. This is a full RGB layout keyboard with anti-ghosting option and it also has dual multimedia keys along with the gold plated USB. So this is from the brand Red Dragon. I got this for almost $60 from United States and this one is called as Devarajas. Now this is actually a Chinese company but their branding is with an Indian name which is quite good. So these are the features. I'm not going to cover them. If you want you could certainly pause this video and you could have a look at the features. Now the box looks quite dirty because I have been using this for almost three, three and a half months now and uh, I wanted to give a unboxing as well as a feedback, a honest feedback only after using it for quite some time. So I wanted to show an unboxing experience as well so that's the reason why I repacked it. So in this case you also have an option of changing the keycap as well as switches and individual switches which I would cover at a later stage. So let's quickly jump inside the box and see what you get. Once you open the box you have the keyboard. Generally the keyboard comes in a bubble wrap. But in this case, it's not in a bubble wrap because as I mentioned, I've already unboxed this and I have been using it. So I just kept it back in. Along with that, you have this keycap remover tool, which is used to remove the keycap. Let's take out the keyboard. And also inside the box, you also have this manual, which has general literature. Along with that, you have this Red Dragon uh, pamphlet on which you have the logo along with that you could give it a thumbs up or thumbs down on their website and as well as you get this driver CD along with that you have an application that you could install to control the individual RGB lightning. So each switches here would have individual LEDs. So you have a couple of options there to customize it. Normally whenever you get go get a cheap uh, mechanical keyboard, uh, the LEDs are like it will be in one row. So the entire row would have only one LED and one color where you don't have an option of customizing it. But this one has a customizing option for each keys. So inside the box you also have a smaller box which is going to be set of keys which I would show it to you. Let me take out the box and along with that you have another switch remover tool. So you have to use the red one to remove the caps and the, the silver one to remove the switches. So this particular box contains different switch combinations. So they also provide set of switches which you could interchange and see how the feel is. So you get a total of eight switches where these are two browns two blacks, two blues and two oranges. So each color has a different feel and feedback to the switches. So you could customize it based on the feel. Now this particular keyboard is by default in brown color. All switches are in brown which, uh, which are considered as tactile but these would give you a linear uh, feel, linear switch feel. And these are from the brand Otomo and uh, these brown switches provide gives you a force of 55 grams. So the force that is required to press them is 55 grams and uh, the entire switches or rather uh, the entire switches are in brown but I have customized it only the arrow keys which I would show it to you. Now guys, before I could actually cover something else here, yeah, I just want to quickly point out that the reason I bought this was because of the option where you could switch the switches to a different brand if you want to. 
so I thought I could move to a different switch uh, brand but however in this case this particular keyboard can only fit with their original keys that is only if you buy switches from Otemo company only that would fit inside that PCB because these switches have a thinner pins but whereas other brands maybe for example Cherry MX has a wider pin which would not fit in this keyboard so that's something which is disappointing uh, which I didn't expect but I'm just letting you guys know that if you are planning to get it and if you're planning to change the switches the only option is to switch with Otemo brand now the entire keyboard is made up of aluminium and has a powdered black coating on it and the feel the stiffness is quite good and you have this uh, stance which you could pull out now guys as I mentioned I have been using this for almost three three and a half months uh, now if you if you ask me the honest opinion is that this particular keyboard gives me a good experience uh, so uh, moving from a membrane to a mechanical keyboard really is an, a different experience that you should all have because I mean even I was thinking of moving I mean always using a membrane but once you get used to the mechanical keyboard feel you would never jump back to membrane that's something which is there and each keys are double shot which means that you, these would not fade that soon and also the LEDs which glow behind the key would actually eliminate the key that has been embedded so the keys would be visible I would actually show that at the end of the video so this is how you should pull out the key you should use that silver tool and uh, pull it out uh, the key the switch actually comes out quite easily and you could interchange it with the predefined keys that I've provided and those are the points in which the key sits down and on the top you have this LED now being in the brown switches uh, so the feel is quite good uh, and uh, the blue actually uh, is also good but uh, when this is this is the default that is provided so you could customize it based on the based on the field that you get overall guys I'm pretty satisfied with it uh, I mean for $60 this is quite a good bargain and uh, if you are in a market to buy a mechanical keyboard for your gaming experience you could certainly give this a shot this is Devarajas again and the model number is K556 now I'll show you to you the typing experience and the sound that you get the feel that you have So this is how the key keyboard looks like once you connect it so these are the uh, LED illumination options I hope that you like this video if you have any suggestions do leave it in the comment section below if you have not subscribed to my channel do subscribe to it and if you have any uh, feedback do leave it in the comment section below thank you so much for watching